The word for today, expect good things from God. Your concept of God determines your confidence in approaching Him. Do you view Him like an auditor and your books don't balance? Or do you view Him like a Father who loves you at all times and wants to be good to you? When approaching God, you may consult your mental scorecard to see whether you have more wins than losses, rights than wrongs, credits than demerits. If you feel like you're not performing well, you may avoid God or make him your last resort. That's a mistake because God sees you in Christ, 2 Corinthians 5, 17, and therefore you are always accepted and welcomed into his presence. You say, does that mean I can live any way I please? No, the Lord disciplines the one he loves, Hebrews 12, verse 6. But his correction is not rejection. It's proof that you are truly his redeemed child. Here's a scripture you need to meditate on. Therefore the Lord earnestly waits, expecting, looking, and longing to be gracious to you. And therefore he lifts himself up, that he may have mercy on you and show loving kindness to you. For the Lord is a God of justice. Blessed, happy, fortunate to be envied are all those who earnestly wait for him, who expect and look and long for him, for his victory, his favor, his love, his peace, his joy, and his matchless, unbroken companionship. Isaiah 30, 18. This is God's attitude to you always. The Lord earnestly waits, expecting, looking, and longing to be gracious to you. Start expecting good things from God. That is the word for today.